Yeah, I'm Matthew Meadows. I'm a Euro Partners urologist. BPH is benign prostatic hyperplasia or benign prostatic hypertrophy. It is the non-cancerous or benign growth of the prostate that occurs in almost all men with age. With the prostate sitting interposed between the bladder and the urethra, growth of the prostate can cause significant symptoms related to urination. Patients who suffer from BPH complain of symptoms generally related to their urinary pattern. They may find that they have difficulty starting their stream, they may feel they're unable to empty their bladder completely and have to return to the bathroom shortly after believing they've finished. Often patients complain of having to get to the bathroom very urgently and even sometimes not making it to the bathroom in time and having incontinent episodes. Additionally, the nocturia or awakening at night to use the bathroom can be a very bothersome symptom. This can keep them from traveling, this can keep them from participating in sports or social activities they did previously. Treatments for BPH range from dietary or lifestyle modifications up to surgical procedures. Uh, medications uh, generally work by relaxing the muscle within the prostate gland so that the urine can flow more easily and this can alleviate many of a man's symptoms. There are other medicines which can actually stop the growth of the prostate over time. If medicines are not successful, uh, the next step is often what we call minimally invasive procedures. All of these procedures work to either shrink the prostate or increase the opening through which the urine passes through the prostate. This can be done by using lasers, uh, stitching open the prostatic urethra, using steam to shrink the prostate. All of these can be effective at helping the symptoms. As the largest urology group in Chicago, Europartners sees a significant proportion of BPH patients in the Chicago area. So we see patients from all geographic areas, all economic strata. Uh, we are very much in tune to the concerns of different patient populations and understand that different treatments are right for different patients and are prepared to offer all those treatments to our wide variety of patients. Mm -hmm.